Hey guys, take a moment to video for guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your QR code scanner not working on your iPhone. In this video, we're going to walk you through all the troubleshooting steps that you know need to know, and hopefully by the end of it, your QR code is working. So when it comes to the QR code scanning on your iPhone, generally you open up the camera app, you're going to be on the photo mode, and it should pick up whatever QR code uh, that you have. So first thing is that you want to make sure your phone is compatible. So QR code on the iPhone works with iOS 11 or later. So if you have an older version, unfortunately, it will not work. And when you do have it open up, if it picks it up, you can simply click on it and it will work. Let's say it's not working. What I like to generally do is first troubleshooting step is just simply swipe up and close out the camera app and then relaunch it again. And that hopefully will fix any little software issue that it may be experiencing. I also want to ensure again, it's on the photos mode if it's on video it will not pick it up or in the portrait mode as well it will not pick up the qr code so it has to be on the photo mode as well now after you have done that the next thing you want to also ensure is that the qr code that you have is well lit so that you know if it's a darker one sometimes there's sun reflecting for outside if you're in a darker room it won't recognize that along with that is that you want to also clear make sure that your lens are clean so if the lens over time has like dirt or dust buildup, it will block that QR code scanning. So you want to ensure those lens are clear. If you have a case or something on something, that could also interfere with it as well. Now, after that, you want to go ahead and do a forced restart of your iPhone. So in order to do a forced restart on your iPhone, you're going to press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down, and then hold the side button here until the screen goes completely black. At that time, you'll let go of that button and then the phone will be forced to restart. So volume up, volume down one after another, and then I hold the side button. The side button here, I'm just gonna keep on holding until the screen goes completely black. So as you can see here, it's still, it's gonna take a moment or so. And then once it turns completely black, we're gonna wait till the Apple logo reappears and then we'll let go of that button. And what I have done is completely shut down the phone and it's reloading the code. So if it's a code related issue impacting our iPhone, for the QR code not working, it will hopefully resolve that issue for you. Now, this method will not delete any of your personal data, so all of your photos, videos, apps will all be there, so you don't have to worry about it. The next thing you want to ensure is that it's a common uh, thing that if you go into setting of your iPhone here, and then look for the camera setting here, so you'll see here there's a bunch of options here. So we're going to look for the camera settings here. So you'll see here you got a bunch of options and then the camera setting. In other camera setting, you want to ensure that the scan QR code is enabled. It should be enabled by default, but for some reason, if accidentally turned it off or it got turned off with the new software update, you want to ensure that it's enabled as well so that the QR code scanning works. Now, along with that, now so having issues with the, maybe the camera app doesn't recognize QR code for some reason, there's actually a tool, if you go into your settings of your iPhone, under Control Center, and you look here, there's the option for code code scanner, which is right here. If we click on that and then exit out of that and pull on the top of our menu here, you see there's a new option where we can scan codes, specifically built for code, and you can use a flashlight as well. So as you can see here, this will definitely help when it comes to opening up any QR code. So go ahead and try that built-in tool as well if the camera app isn't giving the result you like. And finally, if you still are having issues with both the app or the QR code scanner, you can go into your setting of your iPhone and ensure that your phone is up to date on the latest version by going into settings, general, software update. And if there's an update available, it'll show up here. You can download and install. Make sure your phone is at least 50% or more charged or plugged in and has a good strong cellular connection or Wi-Fi connection. Give yourself half an hour to 45 minutes to be able to successfully do the update. And hopefully by end of it, your QR code scanning is working again. And I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make sure to like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.